Hello, everybody. This is Resident 51 here. We met some more people around here, the thousand year doll. Woohoo! Okay, so, last time, we defeated Rock Hawk. We defeated Macho Grubba. Ooh, yeah! <laughs> and Prince Mosh just save, and then we also have attained. Our third crystal star. The object Jolene gave you at the Fiend Grubba. And P. Elder in the Retreat. Crystal star found in Hooktail's bed, eh? So Crystal Star number 4 is up for grabs next. Alright, I'll take this off. This off. Put that, put that right back on for now. Keep that damage touch on just be safe. Uh, put multi bounce back on. Yeah, I think that's good for now. Oh, and <laughs> uh, before I actually do start, <laughs> I, <laughs> my friend gave me a little Mario-related thing for me to, to see that it did give me a good laugh. <laughs> so forgive me if I try to sing this and all, but this was just too funny. Um, I'll, t I'll definitely, no. I will definitely get that though, surely. <laughs> Country lords, let's go. It's a me, Mario, Mushroom Kingdom, Mamma Mia, take me home, Rainbow Road. <laughs> oh, Jimmy <GB> Christmas. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> it was just too funny. <laughs> I loved it, though. <clears throat> Okay. Now, anyway. Um. Actually, let me take a look here real quick. Oh, really? I missed a star piece here? Hmm. In the good spit, huh? Well, we'll come back here and check later. We'll, we'll figure out what items we missed throughout the game. But for now, next sheet blimp is bound for the town robot. Check the board. Yes, please. Everything looks in order with your tickets. Please watch your set as you board. Thank you. Oh, yeah. I guess we'll go ahead and skip this and save some time. We'll make it a little easier. Alright. The most, cool, the most sun chapter is over with, but we gotta move on, though. We got, we got a job to do. Oh, hello. Gonzalez, you got an email. Yes, I do. Let's see. Dear Mario, I've been cursed and terrible. These things, the exons, they're planning to control the world. It's true that in that... It's true that in that they're seeking the crystal stars and trying to claim a legendary treasure. I still don't know what the, that treasure is, but you must hurry and gather the crystal stars. I will gather what information I can. Princess Peach. Those dudes want to rule the world? That would stink! Yeah, you're removing. Hey, what's wrong, buddy? Well, said that agree, man. That was close. I know where that thing leads you to all too well, and I don't want to go there. Hmm. Well, be more careful next time, okay? You definitely don't want to go down there, that's for sure. Dangerous stuff and everything. And, oh. Well, it was too early or sooner ago. Let's uh, talk to you first. Hi, I guess. I'm Jerry. I'm Bob. I'm from Plump Belly Village. Nice to nice meet you. Sorry, I said so down, but you would, you would be too if you seen Luigi's big cryo stunt show. He's so clumsy in heels. He was like a wobbly force of nature falling down everywhere, knocking things over, tumbling the people. Now I have an obligation to tag along and clear the area of if the weedy someone just glances at a stiletto. Somebody has to be the herald of the coming wobble wobble pucklups. <laughs> That's why I'm sticking close to this guy. <laughs> oh brother, what you get yourself into now? Uh, I got my second piece of the marvelous comments at Plump Belly Village recently. Ooh boy. I really have my hands dirty on that one, I'll tell you what. Better read a while, bro. Wanna hear what happened? It's a long story. 
I call them a Yushi also, bring it on. I guess, oh yeah, sure. Once we made the landfall on the Strudel continent, we made for Plump Bay Village. Once we got there, though, we immediately noticed that something was wrong. We learned from the mayor that the town was ruled by a giant thing named Hiza. He said the beast demanded he offer up his own daughter as a sacrifice too. So, of course, being heroic, I offered myself up to go in her, in her seed. Bravo, huh? Or brave, huh? Now, the custom was for sacrifices to be dressed as brides, so I got all dolled up. I was one hot sacrifice for all. I looked so good, I fooled our foes and got in his eyes and there. It was kind of rough fighting that in that gown, but I managed to I managed. Chiffon really shaps, bro. If I found his uh, and the snake had a second head on its tail, I was scary. I fainted real quick, but when I come to, I managed to strike both heads. It reared up, it reared up, fangs barred to attack, and at that moment, I definitely lunged at left. The escaping mouse smashed into one another, and he vanished in a cloud of smoke. A shiny plate fell down on the spot where his body has been coiled. Yes, another compass piece. I said it, and it pointed east to Circuit Blake's Island. Just as I left the lead town, the mayor asked me to stay and marry his daughter. I thought about it. She was sort of cute, but we ended up sneaking off the next morning. I mean, I still had to save Peta to Claire for the Just the King. And when the Marvelous Clap Compass activated this time, I had somebody's voice. It was so beautiful, bro. I said it. It was Princess Claire's voice. My heart began to race. That's when I realized it. Princess Claire. I think I. Oh, I kind of saw that. Okay. Um, so yeah. We said sail again after Dishon Town. And somehow we managed to get back here with the robot. And here I am. Nah, we're good. Yep. Thanks, bro. <laughs> Appreciate it, though. <laughs> Okay. Now, um, talk to you here. Uh -huh. Any new here, mate? Hmm. I mean, uh, I can use these acts of collection uh -huh. to, to get all the badges and stuff. So yes, this will actually be very helpful. It costs a lot of money. Dang, I'm not gonna be able to get them both. Um, I'll get the Ultra Wish for now. I don't want to save it. I'll come in for that jam and jelly later. I know you do. I appreciate that. Right. Um, Hilsa? Need to source them real quick. Um, this, please. Thank you. What do I hear you say? It? Too many mushrooms at the moment, that's for sure. Uh, yeah, I'm good. <laughs> nope, all good here. Thanks, Ray. <laughs> Alright. Hmm. Um, yeah, let's go do the badges, too. I got some to sew. Oh, it's so worth. Hello? Hello? <sighs> but, um,. Right, how is everyone doing though today? Ooh. I see a piercing blow, Marty would like. I need 70 coins. Yes, I'm selling. Um. Man, yeah, been doing okay lately myself. Hope you all been doing well too. I'm um, just. Just days of working through and just. Making time to sub at home on free days. I don't think about keeping that. I don't know yet. Only well, because it costs six, but it's very good for the partner to have. Mm, let's still keep that. I'm not gonna reuse these, to be honest. I know these were like, why aren't you gonna use those? It could help you every in, in, in a pinch. Yeah, true, but um, I'll be okay. 
I don't know if it's you, you put on one more of the same batch will increase your chances. Um, I'll keep it around just in case, but I don't know what's gonna happen though. Oh, that was a, that was a second damage dodge, wasn't it? Yeah, take it off here. I'm not selling that quick change badge. No way. That is too good to keep. That's too good to sell. And nope, keep the Sasha Tunes. Nope, that's it. Alright, Piercing Blow. Yes, I would love to have that. I don't have this, I'll buy it. Thank you. Yep, I'll buy the rest of these. And I already sell them because uh, I need the money. <laughs> Mainly do this to get the uh, the badge collection taken care of while I'm at it here. Yeah, I don't really want to have that, but maybe later on when I'm trying like weaker, weaker enemies, maybe we're only get like a mega star point out of it. Then sure, I could do that. So I don't have to worry about it. All right, now it's a nearly 900 coins. That's much better. All right, uh, piercing blow. We're definitely gonna put that on because that will be very helpful. <laughs> Some enemies will fight be fighting in uh, check of um. At least a certain move if I in Chapter 4. Oh, yes, my good man. I'll, I'll buy that jam and jelly you got now. There we go. Okay, oh, yeah, there is someone else I need to go talk to, too. I need to give him some coins for this. This will pay off later on. Hey, you're Mario? Wow, this is so cool. Never thought I'd be able to slip me out here. I know. Do you want me to make it a vest, Mario? My name's Lumpy. I'm heading out to dry, dry desert browser for oil. Oh, yeah, I'm back from Paper Mario. Huh, cool. I lived my life hoping to get rich quick, rich quick, and now my chance has come. I still don't have enough star funds. Could you please send me some money? I'm sending the best editions of 100 coins more. Yeah, go ahead. Thank you so much. You won't regret it. Oh, yeah, I think... I think you need to do this, like, once every time you see him. I don't know, I guess depending on chapter progress, I'm not sure. But I guess they change it now where you can actually do this as much as you like. Up to now. Yeah, we'll have another hunter. Think you'd be able to be, to think you'd be willing to invest so much money into my endeavor, there should be more than enough. I promise you, I will strike oil, so expect good news. Alright. I know you will. You did before, and I hope you'll do it again. Ah, uh, yes. Let's take a new shortcut. Things a lot easier on ourselves. Oh yeah, I haven't put the third person star down yet, so gotta wait first. And hello, Shine Sprite. Thank you. Mm -hmm. this sounds cute. Ah, dang it! I didn't mean to go back up. Whoopsie. I'm on your goals. But yeah. Waiting for some games to come out at the moment right now. Well, the next one I'll be waiting now is, um... Well, I have a chance to repop. Well, the day I'm recording this, which is September 10th. Yeah, a couple more days. So that comes out, so... I'm looking forward to playing it. Should be a lot of fun. Alright, well, let's take you out first since you're attack me. Yeah, I'm looking forward to playing that. It's gonna be a lot of fun to play that again for old time's sake. Oh! <laughs> Not the best time for that, but thanks. 
I'll take some extra coins. You know what? I can't complain about extra coins. That's always nice to have. There we go. Much better. Alright, let's go. Crystal start number three. And now, it's time to reveal the fourth location. I love this still. This is still so cool. This remake is so by far incredible. Alright. Our next area. I still like this one. But not that much. Before then. And we're looking for the Ruby Crystal Star there. Shows where the fuck Crystal Star is. Guess I'll have to show that this to that Frankie guy. The first you better tell him what Princess Peach said, right? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, definitely. That's very important. So he'll know what we're up against. What? <laughs> the group that kidnapped Princess Peach has been on total world conquest. Uh huh. You got that right. That's why these jokes need the le that legendary treasure. <laughs> this does, doesn't bode well. The situation has gotten far more serious than I thought. Let me bring you up to speed. I'm just researching just what the treasure could be. One book I came across held to what I thought was a preposterous theory. The book claimed that the treasure wasn't actually the great catalyst. The very catalyst that a thousand years ago sank that town underground. <clears throat> So these chicks think the power that that chasm will help them rule the world? I can't say for sure what they will do or why, but we must consider the possibility. Now that things have come to this, we mustn't let them near that legendary treasure. That's all that matters, because if you, they do get it, then once again, this town, you know, the entire world, could be destroyed. Did now with the uh, prof? We gotta find that next Christmas star super quick. According to the map, is it appears that the next crystal star is in Twilight Town. Twilight Town? To tell you the truth, I don't know much about the place myself. Only rumors. I've heard that, as the name implies, it's perpetually dim and eerie there. Wait just a moment. Aha! There appears to be a pipe, but Twilight, the Twilight Town is somewhere here in Roadport. I think he's somewhere underneath the west part of town. Yes, definitely. You get stuck for any reason. Just come back and see me again, okay? Under the ground to the west part of ta uh, town? Check. Gotcha, Pruff. Come on, get out. Let's go. Time to break out. Yeah. There. Okay. Yeah, there's a cup of town I want to search. Alright, but... Oh! Hello, Hoopy Coo. Uh, let's read our meal here, but first... I'm gonna throw it there. <coughs> Dear Marty and Coops, I hope you two are doing okay. I have to admit, when Coops has gone, I haven't been doing very well. I get lonely and I go into Coops' house and I smell that Coops smell. A Coops smell. He has his hair cologne or whatever, but it makes me so sad. Oh. Lately, the place is starting to smell more like a dad, Coopley. He has his own smell and it's weird. I think maybe it's the smell of hotels got Ew. It's disgusting. Now I gross myself out. Oh, and since he's gonna be my dad, too, someday, I better get used to that smell, huh? Oh, what am I writing? I am so embarrassed. I'm sending this anyway. Hee hee hee. La Koopy Koo. What is wrong with you with that? Seriously. Oh, our name mission number two. Oh, Mamma Mia, this is a long one. <laughs> Alright. 
It comes to life that after sailing into life at our inn, Toltor has often been spotted in the company of Zesty. The tortoise finicky Zesty surprised all when she was heard saying, What's wrong with, t with spending time with my little toad? Total toes? The possibility such a comment opens has uh, a comment uh, opens has our eyes and ears glued to the situation. Shop re report go. A focus of attention this week? Putin's great tree shop. Pu uh, pungent, easygoing management philosophy is money and customers are fickle. So easy come, easy go. You know, he fully understands why his shop isn't busy busier too. We're, all, we're well hidden, but like any good treasure, we're worth looking for. He even has a special offer for RDM readers. For the next 15 minutes, I'll give you double shop points. Uh, see, today's yummy recipe, spicy soup. See the fire flower and hot water and presto. You're done. The perfect first meal for kids to cook. We've been working all night to bring you the editor of RDM. Look forward to more hot hot news in issue number three, coming soon. Publisher Report Restoration Committee. Thanks for that. Okay. Now, Merlin. Hello there. Yes, please do. Uh, my little friend here, Shadow, is ready to be upgraded. Yes, here you are. Just don't tell anybody about uh, from El Isle Delfino about this. <laughs> um, I'm sure it's a price for 40, so no thanks. Thank you. So now with our little guy Yoshi uh, powered up, he gets the mini attack. Throw those eggs at enemies to shrink them to tiny size, which can be very helpful. Use Yoshi for a minute here. Was there something going over here again? Oh, the star is this. Another star piece. Alright, and I'm gonna go over here. Another shine spray. Now I can go power a floor if I want to. But, uh, yeah, oh, and hi there, buddy. Um, I'll talk to you later. I will talk to him so read about his stories, too, and such. I mean, the hermit said this whole thing, I need to do everything here as possible. Yes, yeah, so I'm getting back on Pokemon, Brody Diamond. I did record a video already. Again, I just been more glued to thousand your door, but I am really good. Um, the continuation of um, uh, Brilliant Diamond going as well, so. Just right now, I'm just in a mood for this tonight, but I'll probably do more uh, Brilliant Diamond tomorrow. Mamma Mia! And yes, I have not forgotten my kitchen and path either. I'm just having trouble trying to be able to do with that still, and I probably just need to continue with like the basic story stuff and more stuff being available by then probably make things a little easier on my end. So yeah, I'm just trying to think of a proper Damn it. Yeah, well that's better. Yeah, I'm just trying to figure out what to how to work that out so I can maybe get back on that playthrough, too, because the, the Genshin and Pathfinder videos are always are going to be at least an hour long or so. I'm, I'm going to keep those videos always long because of how much there is to do on there. Anyway, to Twilight Town. Oh! The pipe rejected you. What is you, lousy pipe? You gotta tell the professor about this. A pipe rejected me? Ooh, that's not normal. Do you think? Nice. Don't! You shirk. Well, you see the first look at the new stage as well. Okay, 
Okay, that was a bad call. Um, no. Honestly, I probably should just, uh, just not switch the fight. Into a distance set, I don't know what I'm thinking. There we go. What's up on hype? So let's get you a little smart out. Anyway, let's go try that again. Yeah, I'm looking forward to some playing games coming up. Um, that, uh, the Lava Chainsaw, um, October. I know there's two games coming. There's a Patrick game coming out at the beginning of October. It looks a little silly, but um, I want to I look at it a little more and see if I may get that one or not. And for... I should hold that thought for a minute. Yo, know, Prof, we found your pipe and that thing's all stopped up. We tried to try, but we can't break through it. Can you drain clear? <laughs> What? You can't get through the pipe, you say? How odd. I'm afraid I have the focus idea what you should do. I sure I got it. Oh, of course. I've heard that a fellow from Twilight Town lives here, report. If anyone knows how to get through the pipe, it'll be him. His name was, a uh, Dang, what was it? Ah, yes, the lover of dark places, Darkly. I see him loitering around here in this part of town in the past. Love for Darkly. Yes, sir. How many chains press that now? I have four. I'll definitely be getting more for sure. So, you know what? Yeah, let's go ahead and get Flurry up for you, too, already. Yeah, her move will be Lip Lock, which uh, does her fills and she can regenerate about 3 4 HP. Get some more uh, HP too. So it's at the 25 now. Oh, excuse me. Probably gonna be for bed after this. It's uh, yeah, about 11 now. So yeah, usually my days off. I do stay a little later, but I'm gonna get some sleep. Ah, there. Need to start I'm a Twilight Town. Do you guys need something? Huh? You can do the pipe to that town? Oh, yeah. shucks. You should know sweat. You just need to have something that has your name written on it. Don't you have anything that has your name written on it? Come on, everyone does. No? Really? Okay, hang on. I'll write it for you. What's your name? It's a Mario. Mario, huh? Okay. Right here on the C, you're all Ross. M-R-A-I-O, right? Easy there. There, perfect. Well, no. While I'm at it, I'll write your partner's name too. What's your name? Shadow, baby. Okay. Hey, watch for your drawing, buddy. Um, wait, my is taking you to Twilight Town, but I hope it goes well. I'll be rooting for you. Eh, I couldn't think of a better voice or more darkly. Just for how, like, sounding. No. Dark, I guess. <laughs> uh, let's see what else. Oh, yes, yeah, Super Mario Party Jamboree. Cannot wait for that one. It's mid October. Funny enough, too, I asked her like a few days off, so I have like nearly a little over a week off. So the third day I'm off, I'll be able to play that on my day off, which is actually even better. So, I cannot wait to find play it. This will be a lot of fun. Oh, baby. Hey. So sleepy. Let's say we body, because we're finished just recording. So we're in chapter 4 for Picks the Bell Tolls. Now, this chapter, like I said, 
I did like this one. It was pretty spooky and everything, but the bat tracking. The bat tracking I thought was probably the only thing that I really hated so much, along with everybody else. But we'll talk more about that much later. Ugh, this place gives me the creeps. Is this Twilight Town? Hey. It's been a long time since anyone's come here from outside. You come from far away? Yeah, those close heroes. So I'm pretty sure you guys must be our adventurers, right? This is a bad time to arrive. Wait, but you're adventurous. Maybe it's the perfect time. Wait, what? Bad time? What do you mean by that? Come on, tell me. Oh, gee, I don't know. It's a scary tale to hear. It's scary to tell. Uh-oh. That dreaded bell. Oh, no. The bell ring again. Oh, this is so awful. Who could it be now? Oh! Wink, wink, wink. Yo, she's high. It's good for you. <laughs> Whoa! That was the craziest thing I've ever seen. What's going on in this weird, ta weird town? Oh, badness. <laughs> now poor Gloomer got turned into pig. Not good. Ooh. Hey, buddy, you okay there? I forgot about the top of your head. It looks like you got... Looks like you got, like, some stuffing there. Right out of your head that, that's coming out, like... Coming out of there. You okay? What are you, Gramps? I'm the mayor of this town. Some call me Dower. I'm not exactly the shop in the but I do believe you're adventurous, right? This is the place for telling all tales, Sandy. Come. Come to my ha to my home. Yeah. My traveling friends, welcome to Twilight Town. Well, I like talking to you. But welcoming people is generally a good thing. It's nothing but bad here. Hmm? As you may have guessed, our town has been cursed. Oh, not only that eye, those eyes are real. Well, cursed? Yes, curse. That is the right word, right? Yes, of course it is. You see, beyond town is a forest, and its heart is an ancient building, the creepy steeple. The dark creature who lives there, it, its curse or ends. What is that when the steepy steeple bell rings? One of the twilight is living here in the village. Becomes a pig. Will my loved one become a swine? Will I too become a curly tailed winker? I'm so worried I can't sleep at night. Of course, night and day are pretty similar here. If this keeps up, well, the village will be one giant pig pen, which would be bad. Let me give you some advice. Leave us. Leave before you two get pigified. Not gonna have it, Gramps. I'm looking for something really important. Me, Herman? With the star shaped rock called Crystal Star? Um, I don't know anything uh, I know about any Crystal Star thing. But in Creepy Steeple, there's a glittery red stone shaped like a star. Whoa, are you serious? That's gotta be the crystal star. Gotta be. Um, oh gosh. <laughs> that changed on his face there. Oh gosh. I forgot about that. Kind of creeps me out a little bit. Uh, you people, you aren't thinking of going to Creepy Steeple, are you? Oh dear. <sighs> Unthinkable. Nope. He's <laughs> like, no. I don't want to go there. I'm good. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Ooh, hello. Take a fire fire, sure. Let's check the grass here, or at least see what we got here. Not that at the moment. Hello, Gumba. Let me saw a piece, thank you. Uh, 
Mm -hmm. I think you guys have three, uh, three sisters. And that's the monster that is in the world's past here. I'm serious, that's what somebody said. You still want to go through even after hearing that. You need the mayor's permission. Oh man, the old monster beyond that town gate thing? Isn't that kind of cliche? You gotta be kidding me. Fine, let's go ask. Yeah. Right, so let's go see if I hear someone's crying. What's wrong, ma'am? You okay? Oh, customer. I'm sorry, we're not open right now. Huh? Why am I crying? My house has been turned into a pig. A pig? My house has been to the woods yesterday. Cut the arms. But no hustle came home instead of paper turn. This pig! We got into a fight before we left. And I called him a shop this pig. Damn. And now you raise a pig. But he has a sweet set to you like cooking my favorite food on my birthday, you know? I wish I was here by house and it was a such a man, you know? He just did so many weird things when you know. I wish he could do something like call him money you know. And I couldn't really do it without drawing the and no matter how hard that come to I'll think it'll be tough. But I have my pursuit. I mean I I should cut off I took a Slow down, lady! I can't eat all you're putting me to sleep. So, um are you eating a scene? Uh, oh totally, absolutely. Yes, yes. Say, so, should figure out some way to restore my husband to normal. I'll do whatever I can to help. You need to take whatever you want from the storeroom. Maybe it might help, you know. Sure. We'll, we'll do it here, ma'am. Anyway. Well, the bell ring got out. Does it mean someone's gonna... Boy, I'm psyched it wasn't my turn to get picked. Me too, buddy. Me too. Because the last thing I wants to become is a pick this well. Okay, Mr. Tower, we need to uh, talk to you about the. Ooh! Wow, hey, good. Don't you think that pick is the mayor? What are you gonna do now? We need that dude's okay to pass the gate. Poor Mr. Tower got turned to me. Also, I like the moon, by the way. How it looks like it's all carved out. It looks like a wooden. Like, man, it looks like man, a wooden such. It's so beautiful. I like it a lot. Ooh! You too. Oh, the gate has gone. Oops. Nope, not gone. The summer dude's a pig. Why well, is that should be sweet for us? No pigs aren't getting our way. Well, you're right, but still. Guy. All right, let's go. Twilight Trail. Man, this music sounds so damn creepy. It fits so well. And that's a new change. I had a rock here to push instead of normally going through here. There's some black cavity, so we know what that means next. Also, take the bell out. There's more some talent to do here in just a minute. Alright. Time for our first fight. Oh, I see what you got back there. I don't like that. Also, I like the theme for this. is the music here. This is very nice. Actually, before I do the tower, I just want to get rid of that cape. I don't trust him. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Same problem. He got a big buff right now. Tower, you know we're gonna get. Yeah, I wouldn't have beat him either way with this, so. That's a hyper Pumba, which means, um, the hyperactive Pumba, duh. If you eat, it has two pen zero. But if this guy goes south, charges up to the tap, probably will be eight next turn. 
You better wipe it out between the time it charges up and the time it attacks. You can't beat him, then run away, okay? Mario never runs away from fights. <laughs> that did hurt quite a bit, though. Alright, good Bella. Good shot. Very creepy theme, though. I do love it. Very, very nice. Don't mind if I do. Oh, sorry. A bit bigger? I mean... Oh, yeah, it's still a close, so yeah. I know, I'm sure you're not afraid, Gumbella. Don't worry. I'll have to leave her up. He's like, Ooh, I'm so sure I'll take that. Because I have to do more tally with these paracumas now. Oh, you've got a room powder on you. That can be a little dangerous. Okay, well, uh, go right ahead. Let's have all these guys next. That's a hyperparagoma. Basically just a hyperparagoma with wings. Same thing like the Goomba did. After charging up, you'll be dealing with moves that have an attack power and heat. Well, if you jump on it, it'll lose its wings and turn into a regular hyperparagoma. Not that that's all that cool. Not that... Now, not that that's all that cool. <laughs> Even normal hyperparagomas are dangerous. Just that, that's that. So many dads use. Ah, oh boy. Um, just out of curiosity. Okay, I didn't think so. I was wondering if got rid of the hyper bit if they fell without their wings, but no. It's just straight like a normal Goomba. Damn! I was trying to time a... I was trying to get a, um... Super guard. Man, these guys can hurt. That's why these, uh... Hyper Goombas can be pretty dangerous. If you don't take them out quickly, they can do a lot of damage. And I got... <laughs> the rune powder. Okay. Oh. I didn't mean to say that. Sorry. Ah, I'm a super mushroom. Thank you. And I'm going to need that right now. So I'm in a lot of pain. There we go. <sighs> now the spike ones. Oh, you have a boost sheet over there. That's very bad. Let's go ahead and do our new move with this. New star power, the power lift. The best star move of the game. In my opinion, at least. Shit. Ah, damn. What the heck? What the hell? I was trying to move up or in a different direction, but moving back another direction. I don't know what happened. That was so weird. Alright, Bella, do your thing. Hyper Psyche Goomba. It's a hyper Goomba with a spike on its head. See, it's a horror, but well, it doesn't power attack the street, though. I can charge out tap power to the incredible level of 9. That's scary. Be it before attacks or you'll be in peril before you know it. Seriously. If only the this book listed the way to dodge that attack. That'd be nice. Oh, yeah, here we go. This is going to be a major problem. Yeah, 
glad I didn't do the one, the one in the very front, because if it did, that meant a serious problem. That one's too. Hey! Thank you! That saves us some time. We'll get Mario with this so he can have a little more health to tank for the uh, Hyper Spike Goomba here. Oh, we go for a Goombella, though, I see. Snake in the grass. Actually, yeah, I'll do Power Smash. There, are white them out. Yeah, sure. He's a Fire Flower. Yep, that did it. <laughs> nice. Okay, I took care of them. That got a little scary there for a minute. Alright, more money. Nice. Oh, another poor pig. Now, we got ourselves a shop key. Alright, let's head back. We got a uh, shop to go visit. Probably get into it first because uh, I need to heal up badly. I'm in a lot. I'm in uh, quite a bit of pain here from that last battle. I'll do this first, so. All right. Oh, this is a big lock back here. Hello, Jim and Jenny. A boo sheet. Our life shroom, though, very nice. And last but not least, Defense Plus, another great badge. Wait, uh, wait, hey, wait, who's there? As her voice. There's no way that people could be here. Seriously, that's just so unlikely. Huh? Huh? Was it easy? You ever seen it just like this before? Get out of here. No, no, no. I'm not like those chests, I promise. Look at my eyes. Tell me I'm lying. What eyes? Can't see anything. Not seriously. Just get me out of here. You'll see. Don't make me beg. What? Come on. You know how ridiculous you sound right now. I'm laughing in here. You honestly think I'm going to curse you when I get out? Curse you? Well, I did plan on doing something to you. But it's not so much a, a curse as a... Well, I really want a new ability that will allow you to go to such a place. To go to go such a place. Well, that's so nice. Oh, come on, please. Just sign this key and open the chest, okay? I know it's your town summer. I just can't go look for it myself because I'm in here. So pretty, pretty, please. Wait, is that? Oh my, oh my! You already found the key. Oh, happy day! <laughs> Fools! Oh, jeez, I never saw this coming at all. For the third time. What are you expecting? Did you think another new lady would pop out or something? Now I'm gonna hit you with the king of curses, the cursiest curse ever. Fear my terror power, you will know the pain of having your body roll up real small. Be cursed. Oh! <laughs> now you're a cursed loser. Save your suffering. When this curse strikes you, you won't even be able to walk. You'll be forced to roll around as a tacky toad. A tacky toad. <laughs> this suffering amuses me, and I so laugh. And so I laugh. Now show me your cursed plight so I can laugh all the more. Just press and hold CR to rotate the repeatedly. Pathetic. Your pathetic misery thrills me to the core. When you're in that form, you must roll away like some embarrassingly extruded wheel. 
I want to get a good look. Whoa, look at you, the hill for Now roll like a drop, but a scotch on a sidewalk. Well, do you see up here what you are? When the sight becomes too much, press C to revert to your normal self. Don't forget. Okay. So tell me, do you now understand your internal cylindry or cylindrical agony? I understand. I leave you to suffer fools. <laughs> Yep, I'll see you later in, um, in the Pirate Squadro. Chapter 5. You know, Blizzard? I see. Feel free to take whatever you want out of there. That's a good treat for a chance to get my Hudson back, I think. No sense in printing, though. I should get this so ready for business. I sure wish I had my Hudson back in the old form to help me run the place, you know? I know, ma'am. Don't worry. We'll get your Hudson back. Good and healthy again. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and recover. And I'm also gonna go ahead and stop the recording too out of this. <laughs> Take one, sure. Enjoy your rest. <laughs> We'll have a nice twilight. And we just sleep here. We get a peachy peach. Does already do a lot except for getting an HP into a P, but very good to have though for um to make some recipes. Alright. So our progress saved. We're gonna stop here for right now, folks. Uh made some decent progress here in Twilight Town already. And next time. We are going to go to continue to the Twilight Trail and head into the forest and on to Creepy Steeple to find that fourth crystal star. See you all for the next part. Until then, later, folks.